Welcome again guys to biology problems, biology with mathematics. Now this is going to be one of the easiest problems of nucleotide uh, I mean series. Now this problem is a non superpoiled BDNA molecule is composed of 4800 base pairs. How many helical turns are present in that DNA? Now important facts are a non supercoiled BDNA definitely this BDNA is not supercoiled that means it will consist of its general property of base pairs per turn and is composed of 4800 base pairs so the number of base pairs are provided that is 4800 so how many helical turns are present that is a question right how many helical turns are present now for answer this question what we need to know is that how many number of bases should be there per turn of btna because you know the normal property will state us all and we all know that for btna there are 10 approximately 10 base pairs per turn our present turn means obviously helical turn, right? Right? So 10 base pairs completed and one turn is complete. So that means 10 base pairs are present per turn. And now we know the total number of base pairs are 4800. So how many helical turns are present? Easy to calculate 4800 divided by 10. So number of turn 480. So the number of turn for this DNA is 480. That means 480 times it will rotate to make the spherical I mean, helical structure right say very very simple very easy it relies on only one fact that you should know 10 base pairs per turn is the number for btna simple similarly this question can be given for a dna and also be given for z dna you need to memorize those parameters for a dna z dna and b dna the parameters are one thing is the number of base pairs per turn and also you need to remember the pitch that is the distance between two turns right you need to remember these two parameters for all the three kinds of DNA, then you are good to go for any competitive exam.